Hello everybody, welcome back to another video. Today I'm going to be playing the Better Dogs x Doggy Talents next. And this is a mod that we just recently added to my mod pack. If you guys are interested in that, it'll be in the description. This allows you to enable Better Dogs, which are the dogs behind me. They're very cool looking and realistic looking Minecraft dogs. And Doggy Talents next, which is I think a more enhanced version of Doggy Talents. I remember back on 1.7.10 Minecraft, and this was a while ago compared to now, which is crazy because it just feels like yesterday that I was playing 1.7.10. But I used to do a lot of modded Minecraft back in the day. And I remember Doggy Talents was always one of my favorites because it was always so like advanced for Minecraft mods. And nowadays most Minecraft mods are that advanced, but back then it was like iconic. It was a big deal. So now the fact that we can have better dogs plus this mixed together makes the experience a whole lot better. I will also be putting the mod in the description via CurseForge if you're looking to download this by itself or are just interested in looking over the page. The page itself has a lot of information on how to get started with the mod and I have a few of those items right here but there are even more in this menu with the doggy talents next and there's a lot of different things that you can use. I don't know what half of this is. What I'm focusing on right now are these basic items. So it says in order to convert a tamed wolf to a better dog's next wolf you'll need to use the training treat which I have in my inventory okay um where, where did he where did where did he go doodle what happened to you so after you convert the dog you're gonna right click it with a stick it says come here come here age one gender male owner you dun 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 obey others false docile wandering aggressive your dog follows you and automatically attacks nearby enemies but they ignore piglins and endermen oh so they don't just like get you into a sticky situation tactical your dog follows you but refrains from attacking anything unless you use a tactical whistle patrol same as wandering mode but your dog automatically attacks nearby enemies this seems like a really good idea for like big mod packs where you have a lot of different mobs that automatically attack some of your animals like i was playing rl craft the other day and there's random mobs that'll just kill your sheep for no reason like they'll just fly in kill your sheep and fly off that would be really cool to have okay so there's a lot of different a lot of different modes so there's a lot of different things that you can train your dog with i'll check it in a second let me focus on the skin thing left click the style button okay skins 214 wow a lot of interesting skins okay so here are the better dogs this is where they start Oh my gosh, I've never seen this type of borzoi. Look at these borzois. Oh my gosh, Nelson. Nelson's so handsome. Okay, we're going to go back to Doodle's original skin. <laughs> Belle, come here. Yeah, do a backflip. Do a flip. Okay, you are female. That's good. This border collie is so cute. I know that this border collie is also really cute, but I like this one as well. This one's just a little bit more derpier looking. Oh my gosh, I've never seen the blue Merle border collie. See, I've only ever stayed on the older versions of better dogs because the newer ones have all these new coats and like breeds and I haven't tested them out, but look how pretty it is. Oh, why is your neck so long? Oh, that does not look right. The reason that I named her Belle is because I used to work at a place that had a border collie that was given up by an owner who sadly passed away, like somebody brought it in. The owner sadly passed away and they had to give Belle to the vet for a little bit just so they could find a rescue for Belle to go to. I wanted this dog so badly. She was so sweet. She was about nine or 10 months old, so she was still kind of a puppy. She wasn't super energetic. She was very shy, which is like understandable since she's in a new place and she's not sure of anything. And she would put her paws up on my legs and then put her head like on her paws. Wanted this dog so badly. So in the future, when I get to the point where I have the ability and the responsibility to have another dog because Kodiak is very overwhelming. He's a very energetic dog. I really do want to get a Border Collie and to be able to have like a dog that I can train and take places. Oh my gosh. I don't know if it's meant to look like it's rolling over, but it looks like it's dying. That looks like you're rolling over. This one looks like he's having a, a moment. A medical problem that's cute oh my gosh look at the animations oh my god look at the little scratch that's so cute it would be even cuter if your neck was like attached to your body correctly that is just that's a little creepy that's some skinwalker type stuff right there 
Okay, so you're the last one to be transformed. This is Cinderella. She's Belle's sister. Thankfully, all of their genders match up with their original genders because Better Dogs is just a texture pack. It doesn't actually give the wolf a gender. And this was also a Border Collie. Can we give you a collar? Some accessories are not compatible and will not be rendered. I'm guessing that's because the Better Dogs, they aren't quite there yet. It was created in October of 2023 and it was just released for like the newer versions in November of 2023. So this is a pretty brand new mod. Oh my gosh, look, when you make them stand up, they like hop up. Oh, that is so cute. It's like my little Minecraft Pokemon. I've always wanted realistic Minecraft mods like this. Oh, oh, okay, do a flip. Okay, so talents. Guard dog. Increases the chance that your dog will completely block a physical attack. Hunter dog. Each level gives you a 10% chance that anything your dog kills will drop its loot twice. Level five grants an extra 10%, bringing the chance up to 60%. Hold the shepherd's whistle and all trained shepherd dogs in docile mode will rustle up some nearby livestock, amount based on level, making it easier to transport livestock over long distances. However, this is tiring and cost nourishment points, the cost of which is reduced higher with higher levels of the skill. I'm gonna train to level five. Points left zero. Are you in docile mode currently? You are in docile mode. Here, do you wanna come over here to these cows? No, okay, I'm gonna need you guys to all sit down. You sit down, you sit down. These are herdable cows, right? Huh? Look, there's a stick. Look, go get the stick. Yeah. Oh my gosh. Drool throw stick. Oh, she brought it back with drool. Okay, so they the throw stick works. Am I meant to do something special? I feel like I'm missing something. I always kind of miss something with these mods. Command stay, command heal, shepherd's whistle. Do your thing. Okay. So the shepherd's whistle just brings in livestock nearby. And Bell just kind of stays close. That's cool, okay. So the shepherd's whistle is what you need in order for livestock to actually follow you. The dog doesn't do much in that way. Um, still cool, I was just confused on why the dog wasn't doing anything. I am interested in the ride with me whistle, so I'm gonna go see if I can get a horse and see what happens. Hey there, Mango, just gonna hop on here. Okay, Belle is moving around a little bit. Put on some tack and see if maybe the dog just keeps up. Let's see if there's a talent there. Talents, ride my dog. Huh? It's not really keeping up a lot. Even at a trot, the dog isn't really following that closely. I really quickly just wanted to say that the ride with me whistle is meant to be for boats, camels, etc. The wiki doesn't really give like a list, it just says dot dot dot. So I'm not sure if it's meant for just horses, but I do know it's meant to work as they join you on whatever you're riding. Let's go check out the other talents with the other dogs because I do want to try other talents. I was just looking more or less for like things that could benefit my like creative gameplay because I don't play a lot in survival, but maybe I should start. A swimmer dog. Okay, I'm gonna fully train this one. I wonder if they have like a swimming animation. No, they really don't. Oh, they kind of do. Oh my gosh. Okay, I see you over there, Jesus, walking on water. Don't drown, please. Oh, you're like swimming underwater. Okay, so they swim across water pretty well with the swimmer dog talent. Yeah, give a good shake. Let's go over to Cinderella and teach Cinderella some things. I feel like I'm gonna have a lot of fun with this one. Oh my gosh, dogs with a hoe inside the toolbar will help their owner farm slash harvest crops. Okay, so they just grow thumbs basically. Very cool. I'm gonna try and put this dog on my head. Oh wow. She's chilling. Now you have 17. Okay, so the master treat helps with leveling them up. Baker's hat doesn't really do anything other than with the other skins. Let me go to style and skins. Let's select this one really quick. I'm gonna put the hat on you. Oh my gosh, I want to keep Cinderella like this even though it's Belle's coat. I think it does give the collar, but it's just not, it's like kind of hidden. Does that mean I can go and get the other outfits too? Let's give you this one. Aww, look at the little dress that's kind of glitched into the coat. Let's try giving you the other skin, this one, the one that kind of worked. Before. Yeah, the dress looks a little bit better. Leather jacket, death hood wig oh my gosh got the wig and the leather jacket some of these items just 
don't really look that good, but the wig, you look like a founding father. Not gonna lie, Cinderella. Bat wings, crow wings, demon horns. I'm guessing this is like more of like a Halloween thing. Like the Halloween update. Oh, look at your little wings. Okay, let's try giving you the bat wings. That's so cute. What does it look like when you run? Oh, okay, do a flip. Oh, that is really cute. I like that. Oh yeah, we can't see it if we can't see it if it's the Better Dogs model. I do hope they change that, but I think that's up to the Better Dogs creator, the Mr. Blue Yeti creator. I'm keeping that one on. Look how adorable that looks. It kind of looks like the clout glasses. So what I'm gonna do is I'm going to make another wolf. This dog, it is a female. We're gonna do style skins. And what you guys are gonna do is you're gonna help me choose a coat for this dog. It can be a fantasy one or it can be a realistic looking one because I know these are really cool. Um, I believe that's from an anime, I'm not sure. But you guys are gonna help me choose a breed. It can be from the better dogs if you guys want to look through those. I know that the Curse Forge page has all of the breeds on it. I can make multiple if you guys are like, put my dog into the game. I like how they also offered them without cropped ears because I know a lot of people like Dobermans without cropped ears. But yeah, let me know what coat slash name you guys want and i'll make a little dog creation video because i know you guys love naming and choosing and that kind of stuff like interacting with my videos i love chihuahuas I've, I've always wanted a fluffy chihuahua irl i know that they're kind of looked at as like obnoxious dogs but after learning a lot about chihuahuas i've always wanted one just wanted to go ahead and share that mod because it looks really exciting and i want you guys to be able to experience it too if not for yourself then through my videos i also just want to show more mods that riley has been adding into my mod pack also a huge thank you to riley who is my system manager who has been helping me with the mod pack she's been doing everything for the mods and adding all of the special things to help them work well on my server if you guys are interested in my server it is for members only but if you guys want to check it out go to my website which is in the description and it will show all the information that you need to know but if you guys are interested in supporting without the financial part which is perfectly okay not everyone can support financially feel free to share this video or comment or like it kind of interact with it and it can put it into the algorithm and it will help a lot i hope you guys have an amazing rest of your day stay healthy and safe and hydrated and i will see you in the next video or stream look at that chihuahua look at him <laughs>